So to get that texture, so it looks nubby and salt and pepper, pebbly like the tweed is, I can use one of two things if I wanted to try it on um, marker paper. And it would only work on marker paper. It wouldn't work if you're using like a Bristol board or any other type of paper because you need a paper thin enough to get the texture. So I can use either sandpaper that has this nub to it, or I can also use the same mesh as before. So what I would do is I would put it underneath and then rub it to get the texture. So this is using the wire, that's a one step. And let me show you what it would be like using the sandpaper. And this is what it would be like using the sandpaper. But now that's just for the first layer. You still need to add, and I'm gonna use my um, color pencil here, more dots. So let's say I go over it first with the wire. Using the side of my pencil. That's not enough contrast of the dots, the, the nubby pebble dots. So what I would also do is, after doing that step, then I would go through, and with the point now, instead of the side of the pencil, I would make those nubby dots. So that's what I'm doing here. It's, it's dense, so there are gonna be a lot of them. And then you're also going to use another tone of the base color. So I have here this more wine color to add some dots in here as well. You want it to show that it has levels of texture. So that's adding in the other color. And then sometimes I also even add white in there too, even though I don't see white. If you add it in, it adds that added feeling of the layers of color that you get with the tweed. So that's adding in the white as well. Now, when we put this on the garment, we're gonna to look to see that it also, if it's a very nubby tweed like this one, where there's a lot of high lows on the surface, then at the edges, you would dot your edges. So say this is the edge of the garment. You would have these actual dots extending beyond the edge, but we'll look at that when we get to putting this on the garment. So that is how I would do tweed. Dotting it, base color first, thinking about multiple colors to get that contrast, and maybe even adding white. 